This is the Logitech M510 wireless laser mouse. What I noticed first was the design. Now I can't say if it is bulky or slim, but once I place my hand on it, I like how my hand sits nicely on top. My index finger and my middle finger rest well on their respective buttons. And my thumb has its own little space as well. Let's look at the physical aspect of the M510 mouse. From the top, you can see the Logitech logo. And if you move further up, you will find the scroll wheel. I feel like the scroll wheel is a bit loose though. It doesn't have enough friction, but that's just me. The click buttons are good. There is enough resistance to know that you have clicked on something. Plus, it doesn't make that clicking sound. Wrapped around the body of the laser mouse is a rubber-like material. This allows the user to hold the mouse lightly and yet be confident that it will still work properly. On the left-hand side of the mouse, you will also notice two extra buttons that you can customize to your liking. Now, I personally didn't bother using those and left them as it is. But if you want to customize them, you must download the Logitech Options software first. You can find the link down in the description box below. In addition to customizing the extra buttons, you can also customize the scroll wheel for side-to-side -side scrolling. There are arrows on each side of the scroll wheel to let you know about this feature. It took me a while to realize that feature though. Now, let's look at the bottom of the mouse. Here, you can find the invisible layer optics. And as with any laser type material, please do not look at it directly. Doing so may injure your eyes. This is also where you can find the on and off switch. I like how this switch also has a color match description as well. The switch will show a green color when it's on and a red color when it's off. The battery compartment is also located here. If you remove the battery compartment cover, inside you will find two batteries that were included in the purchase. Although you have two battery slots, you can technically use just one and the Logitech mouse will still work. Although instead of the 24 months battery life, you'll only get 12 months. Inside the battery compartment is where you will find the unified receiver. The thing with this unified receiver is that it doesn't work for all Logitech wireless products. Some Logitech wireless products have their own receiver that is only used for that specific product. Just be aware of this. As mentioned earlier, you need to download the Logitech Options software to customize your Logitech M510. There are actually two software that you can download. I recommend downloading the Logitech Options Plus. Now let me quickly show you how the software works. All right guys, I'm back. So now I'm using the Logitech M510. I just wanna show you real quick that I actually did not use the unifying receiver that came with the mouse because as you may have noticed by now, I actually had an old one before. So that old one is now broken. I got it secondhand from the thrift, thrift store with the keyboard actually. Yeah, this keyboard right here. Um, so now I, I bought just the mouse. So here we go. Let's look at the Logitech Options Plus. Now, since I already have a unifying receiver, uh, installed what i did was i just clicked on add device and then what it asked me is to so from there click on logi unifying receiver there and then this one make sure that you turn the device off and then turn it back on again so let's not do that now because i've already done it okay so these are this is the web page this is the page where um, Logitech will bring you or Logitech options will bring you now let's click on the actual mouse so this is where you can all you can pretty much do all of your customizations right so right now I use a lot of calculator so I have my click on the wheel scroll or wheel scroll click as calculator and then you can set this up which this one was set up automatically or how would I say this what's the term where anyway i forgot what the term is but i didn't do anything basically is what i'm trying default there you go so this is the default setting scroll right and scroll left and the free two uh, buttons there they're forward and back so that's where you can set it up now if you click on this one you have a whole bunch of options really 
you know, zoom in, zoom out, everything, like a whole lot of options. And the same thing with, if you scroll this one right here, it'll pretty much do the same thing. Like it'll have the same options. So for all of this, you can do all of these options right there, okay? Then point and scroll, of course, yeah, it will add, you know, what's the pointer speed. If we do 100, like super fast like this. If you go 50, which is basically where I like there. All right. And same thing with the scroll wheel too. So you can do smooth scrolling, uh, inverted. So that means, you know, scroll down, page goes up. And then the standard scroll down, page goes down. So we have the settings. And that's where, you know, check for updates for your mouse. Let's see. My mouse updated. Ooh, let's check this out. Logitech devices. It's been a few minutes we're searching. Uh, we found no device update. Perfect. All right, so we're good there. And that is pretty much it. Now, if I have the keyboard or something else that needs to be customized, then I can do it here. But for now, like even if I click on this one here, add device, like the, the keyboard that I have is K350. It's already there. Can't really do anything with the uh, customize the keyboard because as you may have noticed already, everything is laid out on a keyboard. All right, beautiful people, that is it for this video. I thank you very much for sticking with me until the end. I hope you guys like this. If you haven't, please consider subscribing. Uh, give this video a thumbs up. And if you appreciate this, you know, I thank you. Bye clicking on that thank you button over there will really uh, help this channel out. All right. And as always, I will see you in my next one. Bye.